one minute to be able to unpack for the audience what they should be aware of about Oprah's spirituality, what would you say? Well, that is difficult in one minute, but I'll try my best here. I think Oprah, Bobby, as a person, is really just a remarkable woman. I think there's a lot of good things that she has done. And I, when I wrote this book, I often hear Christians do two responses. One, they say, I agree with everything she is. She's a Christian. It's good. Or Christians will often kind of bash her or maybe call her a name or something or attack her as a person. And so I wanted to write this book to really help Christians to know how to respond and think critically about the things that really matter. So what does Oprah teach? What does she promote? Well, she promotes this idea that we are all one. Theologically, this is called pantheism. Pantheism says that all is one, all is God. This is what she called as Christ consciousness. For example, when Jesus Christ said, I am the way, the truth, and the life, Oprah will say that you can say that about yourself, Bobby. You are the way, you are the truth, you are the life. And Oprah told Eckhart Tolle that you look within yourself and you discover that we are all one, this Christ consciousness. Well, that's the, that, that's the misuse of that scripture of John 14, 6. Because in the context, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Then he says, no one comes to the Father except through me.